The following is a no holds barred match. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 230 pounds. The Superstar! Ever since I took my spot here at the commentary table, I have wanted to call this match. I cannot wait to finally do it. A man who always considers himself main event material, an uncrowned champion. He wants to show exactly why here tonight. Things are about to get good. And his opponent from Mobile, Alabama, weighing in at 350 pounds. Oh! has quite a unique approach. Very cagey, utilizing hit-and-run tactics to keep their opponent off balance. I don't know about the hit, but they always do plenty of the run. You are looking at a born coward. This is a guy who always seeks out the highest level of competition, and I think he'll get it tonight. No holds barred, you know that. When two superstars agree to a match like this, they must be ready to tear each other apart limb by limb. That's right, Michael. This is one of the most dangerous matches you can have here in WWE. The damage goes way beyond typical scrapes and bruises. This could have some serious long-term ramifications. Oof. Tied up between the ropes. It's about to get worse. Look at these knee strikes. Oh! And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. And he's pulled the ring apron up, looking under there for something. He has a kendo stick in hand, and this place just turned into South Swanson Street. And it seems like you have to be at least a little sadistic to be victorious in an ODQ match. Oh, come on, Cole. It's not about being sadistic. It's about being smart. There's no safety net in a no-disqualification match, and that's a big factor in succeeding. There's nothing sadistic about it. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Both wrists captured. And Boom! Good night! What a knee! And he's adamantly in control. The advantage is squarely in his corner. And now gets tossed into the ring. Oh, and a stomp. Cover, cover. Surprisingly quick kick out. Wow. Springboard up. Going up top. Taking head over heels. Being carried around with ease. Lands face first. Just punishing their opponent. Exclamation point. looking for some kind of equalizer here. Clearly thinking there's still trail is what's needed right about now. Does he have him here? And the count doesn't even begin. How on earth could he not keep him down for even one at this point? Gotta find a way to get out of this. Just launched. Ooh, clothesline delivered. Knee right to the gut. Two. 
Holding the slugging it on toe to toe now. Nothing pretty here. Just good old-fashioned fisticuffs. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. It looks like we've got ourselves a brawl here. Wow. Lights out. He's heading up top. Thinking. Look out. Good lord. Taking flight. They got all of that. Just taking flight and soaring through the sky. That is an absolutely terrifying looking shovel. Nothing golden about it. Good God almighty. That could end it all right here. Just one run after the other can't be stopped. And he's getting downright nastier and nastier with each of these attacks. Oh, coming down hard with that shovel. This is just getting uncomfortable at this point. Hoist it up. Boom! Beast your eyes. Can it be capitalized on? Uh-oh, clearing off the announce table. Oh, this is about to go from bad to worse. This is not going to be pretty. I don't want to see this happen. No. Oh, oh, turn out the lights. The party's over. Battling at ringside can be very unforgiving. You have to be careful out there. No protection out here. Up into the torture rack. Beast your eyes. Can he shut the door on this one? Run out of ringside and back to the mat. to our winner, standing tall with their arm raised tonight. This one felt special for the moment the bell rang. We knew it was going to be a show. He had 